Welcome back, everybody, to Falcon Place Basement Season Number Two, Episode Number Three. We're playing with the Rival Gangs update. It's added a lot of depth to the game. I gotta admit, it's really, really fun now. It's really difficult, mind you, but it's really fun at the same time, just because you're always like constantly. It's like, oh, I gotta do this. I gotta do that. Oh, I gotta do this. So, um, hopefully, you've had a chance to check out Episode One and Two to kind of get an idea as to what the updates have all entailed about here so far. But right now, we have stuff to do. Let's get into it. As you can see, our boy Mosh, or it's act that's Victor. Hey, Mosh. You have been injured by the um, Adam stand over here, haven't you? So I'm going to send you down over here to get some HP back, my friend. Now, what we're going to be doing right now is I am going to be building a garage over here. And over here, I'm going to break this down and turn it into an area for more stalls. Because in this dealership, we'd actually hold up to 12 junkies. Over here, we're already pretty much capped off at 6, right? So we'll come over here and we want to build a room. We've got to do the garage here. So, $500? Hey, we have the money for it. Do it. So, let's get this under roll here. We have an extra dude over here, which is fine. He's going to be extra for now, but not a big problem. So, we now have a slot for three. Now, my only concern is, do I have to do the upgrade here as well? Chances are, I probably would have to. We don't have enough power for that, it doesn't seem, right? I mean, should we test it out? Should I just go ahead and deconstruct this one and see if we keep both of the vehicles? Hey, you know what? Let's live a little bit. We'll give it a try. So, demol- Oh, I can't do it. Oh, you scumbag, you. So, I might have to do the upgrade here first. Is that what you're telling me? Before they can move over there? So, we need a battery. Alrighty. Well, hey, you know what we said? We said we'd deconstruct one of these guys and then put a battery in its place, didn't we? So, we'll demolish over here. Don't you worry, you my friend extra seller. I'll hook you up here pretty soon. And we'll do the battery. Battery, battery. There you go. Okay, so now we have the power for the upgrade. And no, 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 don't buy anything over here. Just to give me the upgrade, my friend. Install. So there you go. Over here, we should be able to demolish. Yeah, buddy! Ha <laughs> ha! I love it when things go my way. Hey, did you guys ever pick up the rest of this asset here? Why not? Like, bring it over here. Don't tell me we can't sell it. We could definitely sell it, okay? All right. So, now that we have extra stands over here, let's go ahead and build ourselves another one. We are going to go with... We can hold up to 12 dudes, right? We already have a 3 one, so we have like 9 extra spots. So what we could do is... 4 more customers, the energy... We just have enough energy to make this one right now, huh? Mmm... You guys don't have a battery, don't, over here. That's the problem. No battery. Well, what if we remove this one, and we just add it over here instead? This place could only hold six um, junkies anyway, so I, I doubt we to be selling over here. So, here's what we do. We go ahead and we hollow this out. And we'll add an extra locker over here. Okay. And then over here, we should be able to break this one down and make it into a battery. Good. Gotta use your brain, dog. Gotta use your brain. Luckily, um, we're selling drugs to the junkies. I'm not on drugs as anyway. I probably wouldn't be able to use my brain properly to kind of figure this out. But, you know, we're selling to them, not to ourselves, so we're fine. Place a battery right here. Excellent. Alrighty. Now that we've done that, actually, let's send our boy over here first, and then just so he's ready to go. So, Dino! Move your ass over here. Is everybody working here? You're training. Did you get the upgrade over here, by the way? No, I never gave you the upgrade, because we, we didn't have enough uh, energy. Get the upgrade. Train a bit faster. Alrighty. Um, so, freed up dude is right here. Let's give you a stand. And we'll go with the seven customer one, I think. We should be able to pull this off. It's going to cost, oh, 1600 Oh, that's a lot of money, man. But you know what? The more customers you have, the more money you have coming back in. So, we should be able to, you know, easily make up the money that we have here. What if we went with five? Five is 800 huh? That'd be nine, eight customers here, because we already have three. We can do the upgrade for a six and a ten. Um, I'll be honest with you, we might as well just go with the 1600 now. Let's do it. Get it out of the way. It's going to cost me money, I'm aware, but at least now we could sell drugs here up to ten junkies. So that's going to definitely increase our income coming in. Now, the only problem is, can we keep up the supply? I'm pretty sure we should be able to, but... We'll keep an eye on just in case. Junkies! Come over here! Got plenty of drugs here for sale, you see? 
<laughs> sure, I, not sure why I'm a mob here suddenly, like, you know, some sort of Dick Tracy movie. Hey, yeah, we got drugs for sale here, you see? Hey. Not sure what I'm talking about here. Yeah? Alright. So, let's see. How are you doing over here, Keith? You're still training away. If I gave you some more stamina, you would train for longer periods of time. But honestly, stamina is only useful for, you know, training for longer periods of time where there's, like, you know, physical training. Uh-oh! Oh! oh. Stop, stop. <laughs> Mosh, come down here, my friend. Forget about the acid here for a while, okay? Yeah, just come down here. Oh, boy. <laughs> Good thing I spotted that right there in front of me. How you guys doing here? Good? Okay. Oh, boy. That was scary there for a second. But yeah, as I was going to say, stamina is only really useful if you want them to train for longer periods of time. But the thing is that it takes so long to train stamina completely that by the time you're done training stamina, and then you start training everything else, it's still like, it doesn't add up. The time just doesn't add up. You might as well just skip stamina completely. Because the only thing stamina does for you is just lets you train longer periods of time. I don't think it's connected to HP, if I'm right. If it was connected to HP, at least, it'd be kind of like more, it'd make a bit more sense. But it's only tied to um, training, if I'm correct here. Yeah, because see, health is the one that's trying, um, tied to um, training. So stamina is its own thing. So it's really pointless. By the time you completely train that up, it's like, what's the point? So that's the reason why I always skip that one. Alright, you got your HP back? Yeah, buddy, you did. Alrighty. Very, very good. Very nice. How's our money up? 1400 Yeah, we already made pretty much made our own money back. I just wish we were selling more than just weed, but it does seem that we're selling more weed than anything else, so that's the reason why our income isn't really going too, you know, steadily too fast here. Uh, let's get the upgrade for this. Might as well. I'm considering adding another stand right now. Not another stand, but another, um... Getting another chemist and another um, one of these things here. Well, I guess that is a stand, right? Yeah, there's stands. So another stand to make some drugs. Maybe for some more Adam. That way, um, sure, I'd probably be more in danger with the explosions, but then we'd have more Adam to actually sell. Because right now, we can't really upkeep that. As you can see, we barely sell any Adam whatsoever. Okay. Let's actually... Hmm, we're up to 2,000 already, correct? Let's go ahead and increase our supply of junkies here. I'm going to say for this, we upgraded for one to get um, faster resting. And over here, we do the upgrade for one extra junkie and customer. This will bring us up to six, well, it'll cost me 600. Install that one. And then we'll do the same over here. Oh, we'd have enough power now, really. Did we not? Oh, okay, hold up. We'll do that. There you go. So now we're serving 12 junkies over here. So that'll at least be a bit better for us. Over here we're maxed out at the 6, so there's no more increasing over on this side. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I think more production is going to be probably useful for us right now. Maybe even another dude to start training away. We can't hire anybody else, though. So we'll come back over here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's just do some... Oops, stop, stop. Stop moving on yourself, camera. Let's just do an upgrade to this slot. 200 for... Uh, yeah, that's fine. And we'll up... Oh, not enough power here, huh? And that's a problem. It's a big problem. Open this up, and we'll add a battery room right here. Mm -hmm. Place that. Oh! Money storage is okay. It's not a big problem. We have two cops and then two accountants, apparently. Eh, we'll see what they do. Uh, we might pick up the scraps after they're done, assuming they'll leave like, only one person in there. We'll see if we can actually pull it off. And then over here, we want to get the upgrade, right? There you go. Bad trip? Oh, no. Where's that at? Over here. Alright, we got him down, though, luckily. Thankfully, we got him down. Um, okay, well, one second, one second here. Alright, so, hey, here's the problem. This guy is now um, injured. He needs to get his HP back. But the problem is he he handles like eight customers every single day, so we can't like you know have them rest. One dude cannot keep up with twelve customers, so we have to send somebody over here to replace him. Meanwhile, we get his HP back. So, Keith, Keith, oh, you're almost maxed out, my friend. Good, Keith. I'm gonna send you over here for a while just to give me a hand with the selling here. Meanwhile, we get that dude's HP back, right? So get your ass over there. Let's see how these guys do. We they should be fine. The the people that you know. Possess this area before them. Yeah, yeah, one's down already. Ah, he's down. He's down. 
I'm not going to risk it, dude. There's three people there. <laughs> Absolutely not. Alrighty, so here's what we do. You unassign yourself from that. And then, no, no. Is that, is that woman really named Benjamin? Apparently so. <laughs> okay. Um, hey. Keith. You take over this area. You got it? You got it, Keith? Keith's got it. Alrighty. And now we send our boy back over to get his HP back. Alrighty. Oh my goodness god. Hey. Hey, Mosh. You come over here too, my friend. Oh boy. Get your HP back and then I'll hit up the, the other guy. My god. We need a second bet now, don't we? <laughs> Let's keep an eye on this guy. Make sure he doesn't take over the spot. Okay, good. I, I was going to say, don't go over there and start making Adam and Blend blow up. And he just came over here to die. You can train away meanwhile. It's okay. You could probably use it whenever the junkies go crazy anyway. As a matter of fact, once Keat is maxed out, I'm going to have Keat sell for a while. And I'm going to move these sellers down here to train for a bit as well. As a matter of fact... Do we have money? Yeah, we have money. We're going to probably come over here and make ourselves another training room, I'm going to say. I haven't done the productivity one yet, but man, I feel like we're producing fast enough already, even without the um, upgrades to it. We can do the drug variants. That could be pretty interesting, though. Huh. We'll probably give the drug variant a try here pretty soon, but for now, let me get another one of these guys here so we can start training more people. I might be hitting up the prison pretty soon and on and freeing those guys so I can have them join me. Are you fine, Almosh? Get, get your ass over there. And then you... Over here to get your HP back. Very nice. Very, very nice. Okay. You guys are doing fine over here. Do we take over the prison now? We're up to 2300. I mean, Keith's going to destroy this guy here easily. I say we do it. Once this guy's freed up, we send Keith over there to just go destroy that cop and take over the four extra dudes over here. And I'll send those guys over to my basement and we'll just have them train meanwhile. Might as well just buff them up as much as we can, and then we'll have them replace whoever goes down by any chance. Because, again, when the junkies go crazy with the trips... Oh! Uh-oh! We're about to get attacked. We're getting attacked here. We have Keat over here, right? Okay, Keat's fine over here, which is fine. Um, Can I... Quickly hire... Raymond. I just need you to take some hits for me, Raymond, honestly. So I'm gonna buy this dude. And. Shit, Dong, is gonna be kinda scary. Raymond's in the store now. Yo. Oh, I can't send. Okay, I was gonna say, you can't send people when I'm getting ready? That's bullshit, alrighty. Raymond, no training. Move over here instead. Oh, it's only... It's, I thought it was only two dudes. Or one dude. So we're gonna lose our seller, but that's okay. Okay, we brought him down. And then... We just lost the junkie. He got poisoned. That's okay. Dude, don't don't rest. Look at that guy. Oh my god! <laughs> Did you see that? He got up from a, a crouching position just chilling with a beer. He got up and just knocked this fucker the fuck out. That was awesome. That was so awesome. We're about to get raided by the cops over here. Uh, we've had a few junkies die here, and we've had we've also killed a few junkies with bad trips, and we've killed like two of these rival dudes now. We might get a really big fine over here to get these cops to leave us alone. We'll see how that plays out. Um, we lost the cell over there, which is unfortunate, but it's okay. What we can do is come over here now, and then um, hire ourselves Franklin over here. Now, Raymond, you are going to come back over here, Raymond. This guy, I don't know, for some reason, he just fucking reminds me of a Digimon. Metal Greymon! Okay. <laughs> Let's be honest here. When fucking Metal Greymon would evolve, that voice was terrible. Like, it was like purposely like bad words. It was cool. Like, I liked it as a kid growing up because it was just so bad that I was kind of like, it sounds pretty cool just because it's so bad. It was like, Metal Greymon! It sounded like he was constipated the entire time. It was, it was fucking great. That's what it was. Alrighty. Anyway. Let's, um, I think we just hired Franklin, right? So Franklin's gonna come over here and take over that spot left over. Great. Now, what's Keith doing? Oh, Keith's selling over here. <laughs> Keith, you're not supposed to be selling over here, dog. What are you doing, you crazy dude? Well, I guess he was selling here meanwhile until we got HP back, but we lost some people, so I kind of threw everything into, like, a... into a flummox. I'm completely flummox about what's happening right now because we've lost people. Okay, wait, we have two sellers over here, which is fine. 
We have two productions, which is okay. This guy is extra, and then this guy is extra, right? So what we need to do is send extra dude over here, right? This guy. Yeah, Dino. Oh, Dino's been training over your way as well. Dino, we need to send you over here, my friend. And then we could send Keat over to the prison. Yeah, buddy. Absolutely. All right, so here comes the raid. We should have enough money to pay him off, assuming they don't ask for like something really too ridiculous here. All right, so yeah, you, Raymon, you continue training. Oh, and um, 950, perfect, paid. Um, you over here, Mosh, get your HP back before it becomes a big issue with the Atom there. All right, is my guy here? Yo, where's the extra seller? There he is. So, Keat, stop selling. Franklin, take over that store. Got it? All got it. All righty. And then Keto, you need to come back and get your HP back. Bad trip? Oh, no. No, we're going to lose that seller, I think. Oh, my God. He just... What? He killed him? Oh, come on. Come now. Come now. Hey, can we get this um, crazy drug addict out of my, my, my base here? I mean, technically, my entire business revolves around drug addicts being in my base, but not in the bottom levels, you know? They usually hang out on the top floor, not where we conduct business down below. Keith, come over here. What do, you, what do you mean Dean is free? Dean shouldn't be free. Dean, you're taking over that spot. There you go. That was weird there for a second. Hey, somebody... Yo, Metal, Metal Greymon, can you come over here and kill this man? Oh. <laughs> I guess my chemist will take care of it himself. All right, we're fine here. No, no, you're not, Keith. You're not selling, dude. Will you stop trying to be a seller. You're, you're my muscle guy, okay? He's always trying to sell. I don't get it. Yo, yo, hey, Keith, stop. Get your HP back, okay? Get your HP back. Okay. Um, we need to hire another goon. Enemy attacks has changed terminal. They're attacking in that corner. Doesn't really matter to me. Ooh, hey, another fighter. 11.9? Okay, this could be pretty good. 550, we have enough money for it. The only pro- oh, we should have another... Another person coming into the hiring fold. Two fighters, okay. Hmm. Okay, well, I think we pick up Jesse and then we roll a bit until we get another seller. Yeah, so let's pick up Jesse and then we roll a while. I guess it doesn't have to be a seller. We could just probably go with, uh... Maybe with Wayne over here. Has no main characteristic, but it's kind of like all around pretty decent. Hey, you know, uh, let's just roll again. Let me try to get an actual sell. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, we'll go with Alvin. <laughs> Alvin, and, uh, I'm not sure where he, where he left the chipmunks at, but we'll pick him up right here. Okay. So now we have extra people here. Exchange terminal was captured. Yeah, I'm not surprised. That's only one dude here right now, huh? I could probably take over that guy if I wanted to. If I wanted to. Maybe I will. Um, so, here's what we need to do. I have so many things over here going around. So, over here we have two sellers, right? Where's my second seller over here? Yeah, they're fine. Okay, so this area is perfectly okay. Here's where we have to move stuff around. Um, for one, new guy Jesse, you need to come down here and train. So, you stop selling and I need you to come down to train. And then... Alvin... You're the new hire. You take over that store. Okay. Is that good now? Everything's fine. Everything is absolutely fine. Hey, you. Can you, um, you know, train? There you go. Very nice. Now, did I get you guys upgrades? This is my question. Not on the second one, but the first one already has one. Alrighty. And Keat. You're almost maxed out, my friend. As a matter of fact, like, maybe you punch the bag, like, twice more and you're done. So, hey, Metal Greymon. Move out of the way. And let me just max my my boy Keat out over here, if you don't mind. Hey, did you, uh... No, no. Look, unassign yourself from that, please. There you go. And he should be maxing himself out right now. And as soon as he does, we're done. I'm gonna have him go after the prison. Oh! Mosh, be careful with those explosions, my friend. Come on. Maxed. Maxed! Maxed out! Come on, just one more, Rocky. Get him, Rocco! Yeah, buddy, he's maxed out now. Perfect. So, you are no longer assigned to that. Bring your ass down here, and then Metal Greymon, you... I would like you to take over if I could move you there, but apparently I can't. Yo. Greymon. Yo, dog. Get your ass in there. There you go, perfect. 
Alrighty, we're taking over the prison now. I want those extra prisoners. I will be honest with you, I think we're going to be doing is setting up one more stand over here. As you can see, our shelf's almost filled up. We'll do an extra shelf here, we'll do another stand to produce another drug, and we'll do one more training bag, as a matter of fact. I was going to do the drug variant one, but... I guess I could just do the drug variant somewhere else. Like, I could maybe do the drug variations over here. I don't think it has to be in the same base as the other ones. Yeah. So I think we go with more training capacity, because we're going to need them once we start making a push for the Red Rival territory. We're going to need a ton of um, tough guys to um, give us a hand here. So I'm thinking... One more... Oh, wait, do we have enough power? Oh, no, I don't think we do. We might have to deconstruct this and make it somewhere else. Because over here, we obviously need another shelf. No questions asked. Luckily, it doesn't require any power. For a stand, we are going to need... Yeah, like, if we do the acid one, which I really doubt, I, I think I'm going to do another um, atom one. So we'll do another atom one, which requires 10 alone. We don't have enough power for it. So I think what we have to do is... Oof. I might even be forced to move my healing center somewhere else. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I'm going to take a look at this off camera. We'll come back next episode and I'll have a plan for us to kind of go with here because right now I'm taking a little too much time trying to figure out where I'm going to maneuver stuff to, but I do believe we needed... We need to break some stuff down over here first. So yeah, we'll do that next episode around. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a like to support us a lot. Stick around for the next one. I will catch you then.